Welcome to my video. This is Ecogen. Today I'll talk about improvements and ideas part 2 to help make the game better. This video does not cover everything possible. The topic I'll be focusing on is materials. We need more ways to farm materials and a rewarding reason to farm them. Noxon used to be the go-to guy for moonstone farming because his drop table included them. Now no one farms them as he's not relevant and there's no incentive to do so. What I propose is to add moonstones to the drop table for Yun Sang, Yo Heron, Master Hong, and Mao. Essentially all these solo instances after Noxun will have moonstones in the drop table. There will be a high chance to drop one moonstone and a low chance to drop a 10 stack bundle. By doing this it allows players of all gear levels to be able to farm the solo instance of their choice. Plus players who are farming Hong and Mao are getting the added benefit of working towards their bracelet and necklace on top of getting moonstones. The second suggestion is to reinstate hard mode for all the dungeons and increase the dynamic reward for the material box by one. So instead of getting one material box, you get two material boxes for each time you complete a hard mode dungeon. On top of that, if a player completes any of the two dungeons for the current daily in hard mode, they'll receive an additional daily challenge treasure chest. The last idea is to implement a shiny variant of the final dungeon boss. When doing a dungeon run, regardless if it's easy or hard mode, it will be RNG to come across the shiny variant of the usual boss. It's purely aesthetics, no changes in health or mechanics, and when you defeat it, it will yield double the dynamic rewards. For example, if a group is farming Brood Chamber 10 times, maybe they'll come across the shiny variant 1 out of the 10 times. And the chances of spawning this unique variant will increase for hard mode. Alright, so these are the ideas I had to help increase the materials and reward players. Obviously, this video is not comprehensive of everything that needs to be done to help reduce the huge inflation of prices. This is part two of improvements and ideas, and there is much more to come. All videos related to this series will be in the video description. Let me know what your thoughts are on my ideas. Are they good? Bad? Maybe they need some tweaks? Let me know in the comments below. And if you have suggestions to help with the material crisis, I would love to hear that as well. As always, my social links will be in the video description. Be sure to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Peace out.